According to the book titled My Royal Swagger Season 1, the author Marvin Mev Matai, view life in high definition commonly known as HD. During this career, he has interviewed different personality. He witnesses so many works of life of whom he claims still see their life in the old black and white forms of old television or in a fuzzy manner. Different things can happen and because we don't see clearly, we are overlooked, deceived or left behind. By having a royal swagger means that you have the power to make decisions and be who you want to be without being persuaded by society. The journal can be divided into seven pillars, namely, who are you, who are you living for, what's your purpose, where are you heading, why do you do what you do, and what do you want to be. In his observation, the author reflect his love for evenry father as the main saver and the friend of everyone without any cost. By that, he reflect the thinking of some groups of people and societies, their tamdas, the haves and the have nots, the can and the can't. He's creating a society gap between the different sects of society, reading the conflict, sectarian and even religious war. The author also asked that he would not support anyone who would want to criticize, oppose, or even create immunity because of someone's thinking or choice or lifestyle or all being what they want to be, since it's always their personal right to determine their destiny. Usually whenever you say you can, there is always a small voice saying that you can't. But once you start using the confidence which is in your inner self, you can always overcome. In the context of being from a small society or a town can easily cause a person to think small and they have the small thinking, validity, and then have the small thinking validated by other people who just think. And that kind of thinking can never grow an individual at any stage. Instead, self-confidence is the only way of which individual can achieve the first. In the context of Gwanda historical marginalized people, it should be a starting point for them. If you get it, then get it. If you have a dream, make it reality. Your body is your house, and it is time to get house in order from inside out. The author has inspired the community of historical marginalized people of Gwanda by his courageous and sensible words of wisdom by giving them sense of trust in themselves and since after the translation was made for the community about the book the standard of living have gradually start changing even for the Lord ahead is still long and I'm sure we make it through. Thanks.